Okay, so hello friends, today our topic is the non gonococcal erythritis. So, they, so the, if a question came in your exam that a gonococcal a erythritis with purulent discharge, but after doing the diagnosis, that is non gonococcal, the infection agent was not gonococcus. So, what is your diagnosis? So, the answer is non gonococcal erythritis. Okay, so chronic urethritis where gonococci cannot be demonstrated so the infection is non gonococci urethritis now the causative agent so first one is the bacteria so bacteria is chlamydia trachomatis most common it is next urea plasma urea lyticum mycoplasma hominis and l from gonococci these are also gonococci but different is l form so normal routine test investigations cannot normal will not able to diagnose okay now viruses uh, herpes simplex virus and cytomegalovirus fungi candida albicans parasites trichomonas vaginalis now see a difference between gonococcal and non gonococcal urethritis so one said it is a start so gonococcal urethritis 48 hours and non gonococcal longer greater than one week Urethral distress type in gonococcal it is purulent and here it is mucus. Treatment gonococcal septraxone only one drug can treat but in case of non gonococcal in urethritis non gonococcal you have to put different drugs for different agents chlamydia, doxycycline, trichomonas, metronidazole and candida protimazole. Okay, so that was the non gonococcal urethritis. Guys, if you like this video, then please do not forget to hit the like button and also please do subscribe my channel.